In this video today here on Jasmine Coin, Jasmine is sitting at double zeros three. But take a look at the last year for Jasmine. I think right here currently a great opportunity to continue to add to your bag to DCA into Jasmine if you are in fact bullish on it. I expect or I recommend everyone doing their own research here um, in really really taking a hold of your own investment strategies. I think so many people here base what they're into, what they think is a bull bullish, what they think is bearish based on like Twitter. Um, YouTube videos similar to this and then they just get their ideas and make their opinions based on that and they're not really you know a lot of people don't really do their own research so I just want to reiterate that um, you know if you are bullish on a project after you've done your own research you know to be to believe in that project right these things takes time obviously we're in a bear market bull market is going to come and again like I've talked about on this channel a lot of wealth generational wealth could be possibly made in this next bull run I do remain bullish on Jasmine here um, very bullish I'm going to continue to make these update videos on Jasmine moving forward at least once a week maybe twice a week here I do remain bullish on Jasmine as a long-term play here we're talking about 2025 2026 type of range here we're not talking about in the next year we're talking about extended multiple years now holding Jasmine you need to be patient in the crypto market especially in the market that we're in currently um, but yeah not a financial advisor not financial advice let's just get right into this update so one, this major news here, um, the Prime Minister of Japan says the country is creating an environment for crypto and thinks it can transform the internet. Okay, now this is obviously massive for Jasmine, in my opinion, who's continued to be called within the crypto space, the um, Bitcoin of Japan. And with this news, right, we're just waiting for Jasmine, you know, ja or essentially Jasmine is just waiting for things to happen now, where as whole Jasmine holders who are waiting for things to happen. You can see here, Binance launches regulated crypto trading platform in Japan. Binance implements KYC verification for seamless transition effective August 1st, 2023. Um, here's a tweet here. Jasmine, my understanding and opinions, KYC starts August 1st in Japan for the relaunch of a compliant Binance platform. Existing accounts that are not KYC properly through, through the new platform will be closed in the month of November 2023. This could possibly be an upcoming catalyst. Do your research study on your own. Never trust. Now, obviously, this could be very, very bullish for Jasmine, honestly. Um, and then you take a look here. Um, at the Jasmine roadmap, right? And again, similar to this person circling this, this is a roadmap for quarter three of 2023, right? Quarter three of 2023, Jasmine here was talking about um, conduct data marketing verification. And that is kind of what is happening here with, you know, Binance uh, being possibly, you know, now relisted here. Sorry, Binance being possibly relisted or sorry, Binance launching the regulated crypto trading platform in Japan. Right, we are waiting for this to happen, and which brings me to the next thing here is the quarter three, quarter four of 2023. Right, all we've been talking about is the lockup. Right, you can see here this tweet talking about the 70%. I've heard numerous different numbers 25, 50, 70%, 80% of the total supply being locked up. Again, like I've talked about on this channel, we do not know yet what total the amount is, but we're in quarter three of 2023. And we're seeing actually like all of these things that were in the Jasmine roadmap have either happened or have been in the works or have at least the chains have started to move on them. Um, but the start data value exchange is essentially here that lockup what we're talking about. And you can see here, I mean, there's just a ton of people that are bullish on this, right? Waiting information on Q4 lockup from Hara, Jasmine CFO and the team at Jasmine. Q4 is the onset of data value exchange for Jasmine. Shiny days will come with patience. Okay, so I think I just need to reiterate everyone holding Jasmine, right? The price is down over the last month, right? Since, I mean, it was at double zeros four and it's all the way down here. This is double zeros three, which in my opinion, great opportunity here to continue to DCA if you believe in these projects, right? If you do believe in these projects, take a look at this. Bejit, a company led by Jasmine uh, executive Kazumasa Sato, will be hosting Japan's economic minister and ambassador to Bangladesh, as well as others to talk about economic ties for a prosperous future. The BIGT company name is an acronym for Bangladesh Japan Information Technology, right? And you can see here this tweet, everything becomes clear to Japan. Jasmine deploys his tokens every day. Bijit soon receives the minister of Japan, minister of economy of Japan. Bijit was founded by the director of Gen director general of Jasmine. Jasmine is preparing for a democratized crypto and fully integrated Web three. Jasmine is the future. Now all of these things, right? The prime minister creating an environment for crypto. Jasmine quarter four launching Binance launching the regulated regulated crypto trading platform in Japan. Quarter four lockup and then stuff like this news like this. All creates for a very very bullish sentiment very very bullish catalyst and very 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 bullish vibe overall for Jasmine at the current price absolute discount here in my opinion going to continue to TCA myself let me know in the comments below if you guys are as well 
Please drop a like on this video, hit that subscribe button, and as always, you guys have a great day.